Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or hello if you are new. My name is Melissa, and welcome. Intros are so awkward. So today's video is going to be a what's in my purse travel edition. Um, this is just everything I carry with me on my like carry-on bag, not like my luggage, but just my purse. And honestly, it's not a lot different from what I carry day to day. There's just a few other things. If you guys want to see how I pack my luggage, I do have a full video on that, so I'll link that somewhere on the screen or in the description box below. I actually haven't unpacked this from the last time I was on a plane, so this is pretty legit. However, if I was going to bring my laptop, I would bring this bag because it has this middle section where you can put your laptop in. So it's super convenient, but it makes it pretty heavy. So if I don't need my laptop, I don't like to bring it. I travel quite a bit. The next trip I'm going on is to London, Ontario for the Canadian Country Music Awards. So I'm super excited and that's going down. So I don't think I'm going to be bringing my laptop on this trip. It's just like a weekend trip and I just wanna have fun. I don't think I'm going to be editing or anything. So I'm just going to bring a smaller bag. I carry this one with me a lot. I like the size and the shape, it just like hangs nicely on your side and the color goes with pretty much every outfit. So I really like this bag. I'm just gonna start pulling things out, no particular order. Uh, so the first thing, gum. I only have one piece left in this one though, so note to self, buy more gum. Another item along the lines of scent is deodorant. I always have deodorant in my purse and I usually bring one in my uh, suitcase as well. It's just like one of the worst things to forget is not having deodorant, I hate that. So definitely have deodorant. And continuing on with the theme of scent, I also like to bring a small fragrance. They're pretty strict with liquids. This one definitely makes the cut. I think the max is, actually I'm not gonna tell you because I don't know, but this is only like 30 milliliters and I think you can have up to like 100 or something. And then I have pens. And I actually have a lot of pens in here. I think. I thought I had more. Anyways, pens. Sometimes I like to do crossword puzzles, and if you're traveling out of the country, you have to fill out those forms. So I always make sure I have pens with me so you don't have to borrow from other people. I've just been able to uh, handle myself or have multiples and share with others. This little bag has seen better days. It's starting to get pretty dirty and beat up. But this is where I carry all of my lip products and I have quite a few in here. I tend to carry a lot of nude glosses because I feel like those are like the easiest things to apply. I also have a whole bunch of lip balms, some lip liners, almost all of these are nude. Lip balm, this one is SPF, um, and then I have a couple red lipsticks. So those are all my lip products. Uh, it's all nudes, reds, or lip balms. And they all go in this little bag. I think I need to get a new bag because this one's getting kind of gross and the zipper's starting to break on me. Always carry my passport. Even if I'm traveling within the country, I like to have my passport on me just as my photo ID. And when you go to check in, you can just uh, scan your passport and then all your info pops up. So always have my passport. Another necessity is my wallet. Just got all my IDs, my visas, uh, bank cards, all that kind of thing, cash money. Got a few coins. <laughs> headphones are probably my number one, like besides ID and money, um, headphones are like number one thing to bring with me when I'm flying. If there's good movies playing, you can use those to watch the movies. They do hand out headsets, but they're like really crappy quality. I think you have to pay for them too. So I always make sure I bring my own. Keep all my music on here, um, especially now with Apple Music, you can basically put any song on your phone that you want. I actually made a playlist. It's a country playlist in preparation for this coming trip. So I made a country music playlist and you guys should check it out. So I'll have that linked probably in the description box. I don't even purposely pack hair elastics in my bag, but hair elastics just end up going everywhere. I feel like I always need one, and so I dig into the bottom of my purse, and there's generally one there. I have a boarding pass from the last time I was in Toronto, another boarding pass from my last trip to LA, a pair of sunglasses. I usually have more than one pair of sunglasses. Um, these are my newest pair. I wish sunglasses stayed this fresh. They always get scratched, and 
these things get loose. I need to get like little sunglass screw thingies. Can you buy a screwdriver for sunglasses? Cause I need one of those. Where can you get those? This is a portable phone charger or charger for anything that has like a USB. The only thing is I always forget to charge the charger and then it's useless. But last time I brought this and I actually had it fully charged and the airplane didn't have any phone chargers. So I was super happy that I brought this or else it would have been screwed and wouldn't have had my phone. So these things are definitely handy as long as you remember to charge them. I have five euros and I don't know why. Oh, another pen, another pen, my keys. I usually drive myself to the airport and then park it in like the park and fly or whatever. Um, and then you need your house key to get back in. So I usually just bring all my keys. And that is everything that is in my purse. Actually, one last thing that I forgot. Sometimes I bring a crossword book or some sort of entertainment. And if I forget to bring a book, I usually pick up a magazine from like those little shops that they have in the airport. Or I bring my own. Um, I just like having something to read or keep me entertained. Maybe that's not technically in my purse though. Maybe I'm just carrying that. So that concludes the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you think I forgot something that I should carry with me when I travel, let me know in the comments below. All my social media links will be down below as per usual. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And if you like these kinds of videos, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And I'll be back with a video soon. So I'll see you guys then. Bye!